So this is a 1998 Subaru Legacy Outback, and I was trying to find a good video of how to change out the stereo or the deck. Uh, I really couldn't find any, so I kind of figured it out and decided I was going to try and figure it out on video and share it. So here we go. So to start, we kind of open up the tray here, which mine, of course, like most, is broken. Don't need to get that out all the way, we just need to get to these screws. Mmm. I just bought this car, so there's some leftovers from previous owners. So I think the next step is opening up this little guy. I need to put the key in. Pull the brake up, put it in neutral. Turn it on, that would help. This little aftermarket thing is usually where the ashtray is in most cars, but it's been replaced by the previous owner. So, I can take that up. Got it. Alright, so there's two Phillips screws up underneath here. If I can get, get those. Alright. Got one going. Two. Alright, that's what we got so far. Okay. Somewhere down here. Gotta get this plate we started down here out first. I've seen where you can just pry this apart, but I don't want to break it. There we go. Got it started. I'm sure this is exactly how you're supposed to do it. Right, Subaru? Oh. Well, if you look way back at the top, there's two more Phillips screws way back here. I'll have to hit those first. I think. I'm also going to throw this into drive or a gear. Two. Okay, should be a little easier now. Bingo. Hmm. So you just have to get this top one out enough so that you can get the rest of it moving. And the rest is just held in by these clips. Now, should be two more screws, or maybe that was just held in loosely. Yep, doesn't seem like there's any more screws. Just a huge 12 volt adapter. It's got two little pins over here. See that? Similar to the one I was screwing with before. Just pulled apart. There we go. So, base plate, off, got a bunch of screws, got a big hole on the dash, now I'm going to remove the screws at the top here, one, two, three, this magnetic tip helps a lot. Three, four, that's four, not three. There should be two more back in there. There's one more. And obviously the same on the other side. That's for the top deck. I'm not sure if the bottom has a separate one. I seem to have this fancy CD player as well as my Weather Band Pro Subaru deck. 
see if this fits back in here. Very tight. And it's going to drop somewhere down there. All right, I will try the screwdriver this. And that one's gone too. SRS airbag control unit is right there. Wonder how that spilled soda worked right underneath that. Okay, deck, maybe loose. Yay! It's all one big unit, it seems like. A trim that wants to be in the way though. I gave myself a little more room, if you haven't noticed, by shifting the gear shifter all the way back into first with the parking brake on. I'm not sure if that's a great idea or not, but I don't know how you'd get this out otherwise. God, that is gross. Okay, we got some, got some connections on the back to undo. Somebody's note, a password. Wire harness is, oh, that's easy. Out. One more little thing. You can see this mess here. Looks like I need a flathead to get this thing apart. Got it. That's what we got. Here it goes.